Rode Ben, who is from Sattelberg in Finchhafen, started working at the Brown Memorial Hospital Administration in 1984, 38 years ago. She first voted there in 1987. On Tuesday, 12th of July, she was the first voter in Finchhafen to cast her vote when polling started. She said this year's election was different because for the first time ever, voters witnessed the presiding officer displaying an empty ballot box before reading out the serial numbers of the seals to scrutineers and securing the ballot boxes with them. All set up, all set. That's all not all kind of when I'm talking clear all same or all this like me plan. Go to school now, me plan. Go to school now, plan. Now when plant is school talk, now plant is there now. Or work or when I'm here, all this like serial number, I go, I go now. And plant is something to myself, making this like election today, yeah. Ben Feder said they never experienced delays during elections until this year when polling had to be pushed back due to unresolved issues between candidates and electoral commission. Now yeah, I am plenty or heavy now, or something, or pulling tight in, just like I need come, now, delay come, come, now, now election, I'm coming. Past them, plus I, time long, and I'm blah, oh, yeah. I'm blah, ready, and I'm blah, seven, seven, and stuff. Now yeah, no, I all. Ben wondered why there was a change in her district's election environment. Finchafen is the last of the 10 Morobe districts to start polling and is the only district to have three separate returning officer appointments within April and June. The appointments by the Electoral Commissioner only added fuel to an atmosphere filled with distrust and fear. Polling for Finchafen, Urban and Kota Rural was suspended on Wednesday after returning officer Frida Joseph announced that the 2017 electoral roll will be used to supplement the 2022 roll. Frida Kana, TV1 News. Thanks for watching TV1 News. Please like and subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell to stay up to date with the latest news.